Hey, what's going on guys? So you have the LG Stylo 5 and you have the black screen of death. Even though it's a black screen of death, you cannot turn the screen on. However, you may be able to hear it ring or vibrate or it may be flashing for, uh, L for LED notifications, okay? Anyways, your, your screen is still black. You can't restart it or do anything. I'm going to give you guys several solutions to get you up and running right now, okay? So the first thing is this. I mean, this phone is fixed, but let's just pretend that this one has a black screen. So the first thing I want you to do is this. I want you to force it to restart. And how you do a force restart, and you're not going to lose any information, okay? It's, you're going to press and hold two buttons, the volume down button and the power button. You want to press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until we, just, until we see the Samsung logo appear. Then we can let go, okay? So let's all do this together. Volume down, power button. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons. Pretend my phone is black, okay? We don't see nothing on the screen. I'm still holding on both buttons, the volume down and power button. Pretend the screen is totally black. We have no idea what's going on to the screen. We're just waiting for the LG logo to appear. Go ahead and let go, and hopefully you guys are up and running now. If you're still down, we're going to move on to the next step. Okay, so for the next step, we're going to go ahead and do a force restart again, but this time what we're going to do is first, you want to go ahead and plug your phone in, and you want it to charge, okay? So let's pop the phone in, let it charge, let it sit there for about five minutes. After five minutes is up, come back to your black screen phone and do the same thing while it's plugged in and charging, okay? Volume down, power button. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons. Pretend my phone is black again. Do not let go of those two buttons until we see the LG logo appear. I'm still holding on both buttons, the volume down and power button. LG logo appears. Go ahead and let go. And hopefully... You guys are up and running now. If not, we're going to go to the next step. Okay, so you still have the black screen. So the next thing I want you to do is this. Okay, and I call this the uh, the massage method. What I want you to do is I want you to press on your screen, on the screen and on the back. Okay, you can go ahead and use a paper towel or a little cloth. Or you can do your bare hands if you don't mind getting your screen dirty. Anyways, what I want you to do is like this. I want you to start massaging the phone like this. Kind of hard, okay? Because a lot of times what happens is you have like a minor loose connection in, in the back somewhere. And this can very easily pop it back on. So go ahead and keep massaging the front like this all over, okay? All over. Same thing on the back. Turn it over. And you want to do the same thing, okay? You want to press all over. Sometimes you get like a little click and then your screen all, all of a sudden turns back on, okay? Anyways, even around the lenses here, go all the way around. Just like that. Now go ahead and do a force restart again, okay? Volume down, power button. Press and hold both buttons. Wait till the LG logo appears, then let go. Hopefully you guys are up and running. Now if you're still down, next thing I want you to do is the tap method, okay? And what you can do is you can use two fingers, and what I want you to do is tap all over the screen. Kind of hard. All over. Turn it over. Same thing. Even on the lens too, okay? All around there. All over. Now, do the same thing again. Force restart, volume down, power button. Press and hold, wait till, this, until the LG logo appears, then let, then let go, and hopefully you're back up and running. If you're still down, next thing I want you to do is this. I call this the smack method. Go ahead and grab, you wanna hit the front of your, the screen, and the back of your phone on the palm of your hands, okay? So let's do the back side first. You want to give it a couple of whacks. Turn it over to get the bottom back. And the same thing with the front, the screen, okay? Get the top part. And then also the bottom part. Give it a couple of whacks. Now go ahead and do the same thing. Go ahead and force restart it again, okay? Remember, volume down, power button. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until you see the LG logo appear. I'm still holding on both buttons here. I'm still holding. Pretend the screen is black. LG logo. Go ahead and let go. And hopefully you guys are up and running. Now, if you guys are still down, the next thing I want you to do is this. And this may sound ridiculous, but believe me, this works on a lot of, a lot of these Android phones. What you want to do is just grab your phone, put this in your freezer, okay? Leave it in your freezer for about 10, 15 minutes. After 10, 15 minutes is up, take your phone out of the freezer and then do a force restart again and hopefully you're back up and running. 
Now, the thing is, if your phone is still not working, what I want you to do is I want you to start from step number one in this video, and I want you to try every single step five, six, seven more times, okay? A lot of times, third time is a charm, okay? Try every single step, and hopefully you're up and running. Now, if you're still down, the last thing I have for you is to do a factory reset. Now, if you have a black screen, it's, con it's gonna be kind of hard to do a factory reset. Also remember, with a factory reset, you're gonna be losing everything on your phone, okay? All your personal information, your password, photos, videos, will all be lost if you do a factory reset. But that's the last thing I have for you. And if your phone is black, and how are you gonna do a factory reset? Just watch me very closely, but this may take you a few times. But again, remember, a factory reset, you're gonna lose everything on the phone as if you just bought the phone brand new, took it out of the box, and you started off with the setup. You know, you gotta choose your language, choose your Wi-Fi, put your password in, and so on. So how in the world are you going to factory reset uh, this phone when, you, when it's a black screen, okay? So let's do this right now. So the phone is currently on, and what you want to do is this, okay? And let's pretend my screen is black, but let me just give you like, like an idea because it may take you four or five or six more tries to do this. So what we want to do is this. We want to go ahead and force restart it, okay? Once we feel the vibrate and we think that it's about to reboot, just let go of the power button really fast and then click it again and hold it. Never take your phone, never take your finger off the volume down button, okay? So let me try this with the uh, the phone on, okay? Because typically what you have to do is volume down, power button, press and hold. As soon as I see the LG logo, I let go and I press the uh, power button again and I hold it, okay? So just watch this for example, okay? Volume down, power button, ready? One, two, three. I'm gonna press and hold both buttons. I'm, I'm waiting for the LG logo to appear, and then I can go ahead and let go of the power button and press it again, okay? Vibrate, let go, and then press the power button again, and press and hold it, okay? So I'm, I never took my, my finger off the uh, volume down. Anyways, it brings you up right here. Factory reset, hopefully you get to the screen where you can actually see it, okay? Anyways, what you do from here, you can use the volume rockers to go up and down. You wanna go down to where it says yes to select it, you press on the power button here, and then this is asking you, are you sure you want to do it? Basically, once you do this, it can't be undone. If you want to proceed, press the volume down, and then click on the uh, power button. But don't forget, you will lose all your information on this phone if you do a factory reset. I'm not going to do a factory reset on this phone. Anyways, let me know what method worked for you guys. And remember, if the first several me methods besides the factory reset didn't work, try it five, six, seven more times every step, okay? Let me know which step worked for you or which combination of steps worked for you. See you in the next one.